Today we're going to be taking a look at the all new 2020 GAN 356M. So if you've ever wanted the GAN 356X, here is the perfect opportunity if you were scared off by the price. The 356M is going to be the same exact cube as the 356X but with a few different features. So the first thing I'm noticing off the bat is we have this new paper box versus the more heavy duty cardboard that we saw with the, with the 356X. Included with the 356M, if you have the light version like we do in this video, you're going to just have the traditional GAN blue cube bag and the CFOP solving guide. So there's the cube bag and then the CFOP solve guide. But if you actually opt for the standard version of the 356M, you're gonna have an extra yellow, green, and purple GES numerical springs that you can use to further adjust the feel of your cube. The 356M also only comes in stickerless plastic at this point in time, and GAN is really moving away from the glossy plastic over to this frosted finish. So if you're not a big fan of the frosted finish, it might be a good time for you to start stocking up on your GAN cubes because in my opinion, the, from the way they're going, it's just a matter of time before it's all gonna be frosted. So out of the box, performance is very familiar. It's gonna be the same as the 356X. Um, the only real difference too with the mechanism is that we're no longer gonna have the interchangeable magnet system. So it is gonna be one drawback that you have with the 356M. Although from what I can see, if you happen to have um, GAN magnetic capsules for the X, I assume they would work with this cube, but obviously um, you'd have to either buy those secondhand or already have a 356X. So taking a look underneath the center cap, the 356M comes standard with the blue GES pre-installed, and with the 356M we actually lose the dot one setting that we had on the 356X, so now we are left with the .6 and with the .8 setting. There is no need for a adjustment tool for the GES. All you have to do is just use your fingers and just easily rotate it to find your desired setting. I will say one thing I've always really liked about the 356X piece design that is also coming to the 356M is that the center caps are really sturdy. So there's pretty much no fear of those things ever popping off. Um, they snap into place and snap out of place very firm. So again, no fear with that. I did want to mention that the 356M does come with the yellow GMS magnets pre-installed. So if you're a fan of strong magnets, then you're good to go. But if you prefer the lighter strength magnets, this might not be ideal for you. And that's about it guys. The 356M is pretty straightforward. It is nice to see that GAN is taking steps to make some of their most popular cubes available to more people by reducing the price. And in my opinion, I do think that the 356M is a bargain for what you're getting. And I think that the removal of the um, GMS magnets that come with it is not that big of a deal because most people use the yellow magnets anyway. So that's about it guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're looking to pick up your own 356M, grab one at the link in the description below and we'll see you in the next video. Don't jump